I've been playing basketball my whole life, and all I've ever known is basketball. I'm a little tykes hoop when I was, you know, a year too old. 22-year-old Parker Fox was a standout player at Northern State University in South Dakota. He felt he was ready to play Division I ball. In fact, ESPN ranked him as one of the top 100 transfers looking to bring his talents to a new school. During the time he was making that decision, he continued to practice at Northern State. During what should have been a routine dunk for the six foot eight power forward, everything changed. I came down and landed on my left leg and I felt a pop. So we did some tests on it and my athletic trainer looked down at me. He's like, your ACL isn't connected. I had went from this person who was an All-American, who was the, one of the top recruits in the country, and my knee wasn't attached anymore. So like, the emotions that flooded over me were like something I couldn't even control, I couldn't hold it in. Fox immediately called his mother to tell her the bad news. I think my mom was able to kind of show me that, like when people are dealing with way worse things in life, you're gonna be able to come back from this one day. Nine months later, Fox is now strengthening his torn knee in preparation for a full comeback in 2022. So what we want to end up doing is get his injured leg even with his non-injured leg to get that strength up. It's not easy to hear somebody tell you that you're going to be out from the thing you love doing for a year. The fact that I have to sit on the bench and, and watch other people do what I love to do is super tough. Fox has dreamed of being a gopher since he was a kid in Matamidai, Minnesota. But it's all what you make it. You know, you can, you can dread on it and you can put your head down and whine about it and cry about it. Or you can pick yourself up and try to be a good teammate, be a good person, look out for others, help other people. For Parker, with adversity has come self-discovery. You know, it made me realize, like, there's so many bigger things in life than, than basketball. And, like, it's just a game at the end of the day. You know, a lot of times I, I like to call myself a basketball player, the basketball guy, but, like, I'm way more than that. Emma Carpenter, University Report.